Hey guys, Professor M here with MindsPlanet.com and welcome to a secret unboxing. Today we're going to be unboxing the Marvel Legends series HasLab project. This is number two in the sequence, uh, being the first one they did for Marvel Legends was a Sentinel. This is, for lack of better terms, if you guys couldn't tell already, it is the Planet Eater Galactus. That's right guys, we got Galactus here. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to open this bad boy up. That open there, sides open. I can try not to try not to ruin the box here. A lot of tape on it. Oh, we got one more side to do. There we go. Alright, we got that open. All right, all right, so we got the instruction booklet. Not oh, too fancy. We got, let's see here, how does this get come out? All right, this is gonna be the easiest way to do this. Just gonna, you guys get the first look. Ooh, it comes with a lot of accessories. All right. Oh, Jesus. All right. Let's see. All right, moved it up to the on my table here. It's a little easier. Gonna, I don't know. For some reason, I thought these were going to come in, like, plastic. Like, like separate boxes, I guess. I guess that was my, my impression. So, we got... These are all in, this is all, this whole section is in its own. We've got the silver, we got the silver surfer, we got uh, uh, Nova, and I forget, Korg, I think is what his name, or whatever. So he's got weapons, and silver, so, I will, we'll look at those in a separate video. But we're really here to look at. Devour of Worlds. Galactus. And let's see here. We've got... Oh, it's heavy. So we got the Doom Head. Which is pretty cool. And then we've got... Um, we got different face plates. For display. We got Angry... Angry Mouth. Uh, the default one comes with. Oh, get him out of here! All right, so now we're going to. So I have a little bit of an issue. There we go. Maybe that'll help stability. There we go. He wasn't wanting to stand. This guy is freaking tall. Look how tall he is. He goes all he goes up to my light. I'm gonna have to back the camera out just a bit so you guys can get a full full shot here. And we got his horn pieces, which plug in right there. Very easily plugging in. They plug in very easily. I don't know. I think it requires batteries, but I'm not sure where the battery compartment's at. That's probably what the probably what these instructions said. Oh the light up feature here. The first light up feature is right there. And then the second one is in here. Where are the batteries at? Oh, okay, so it takes batteries. There's a battery compartment on top of his head. Holy shit. Ah, uh, yeah, so he took a took a nasty dive there. Um, I don't think anything's broken. Hopefully. One thing, I, one thing I'm having an issue with is the same ability. And I think it just... Yeah, it just... I don't know if it broke or not. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, I took a nasty took a nasty fall there. Um Yeah, I'm not I'm not, I'm not too keen on the uh, on his save ability. He doesn't stand very good. Which is kind of bothering me where I'm gonna put him. See now he wants to lean too far forward. Um yeah, he's got so okay, so the fingers are fully articulated. I'm not gonna go too much into detail. 
it's just an unboxing reveal but you know he's got he's got some pretty crazy joints I'm just trying to see if we can get you know some good posability out of them you know He wants to topple over, and I'm not sure. I'm not sure why. Yeah, look at that. I can't. I can't get him to stand. He's got some pretty intense. Um, you guys see the back of him here. He's actually pretty heavy. He's at least 25 pounds. He's at least 25 pounds. So maybe we can. From what I. From what I want. He's got some pretty, he's got some pretty intense, um, yeah, he's got some pretty intense, um, joints, and, so, yeah, he's just gonna topple over, yeah, he just wants to topple over, yep, see, so the silver surface is supposed to sit in his hand, I don't know how that's supposed to work, <laughs> I'm not sure how that's supposed to work, yeah, I don't want to fall over again, yeah, he's gonna fall over. Yep. You guys, you guys are seeing that, right? A little disappointed. Sad to say, I'm just a little disappointed. He's not wanting to stand right out of the box. Even stand. Okay, there we go. Okay, we got kind of a pose there. You guys can, you guys can see there in a messy kitchen. Can't even get him in the whole shot. Yeah, I raise it up. So that's how tall he is. He's probably standing straight up. He's probably right up to my um, the tip, the very tip part. Oh, you guys can't see that. The very tip. Right here is probably up to my waist, and I'm 5'8". Yeah, guys, this is uh, this is just an unboxing. Just kind of want to look at Galactus. I will do a full video on the channel looking at each. I think how I'm gonna do this is I'm gonna do each individual figure as its own video, and then and like the Silver Surfer, like well, obviously, and then I'll do a video on Galactus just just so you guys can get like a full full rundown, and that gives me lots of time to really play with it. Um, positive so far is that it's really detailed. The paint, it, it material, it, it fell. You guys saw that, I'm not gonna cut that out. It literally fell, and it's not broken. It's not, it, I don't see any paints chipping or scratching. This is the best finger articulation I have ever seen on a figure. Like, like, Third part, like I, third party people, they they make some pretty good articulation on, on figures with their fingers. This is amazing. I mean, of course, this. I mean, this was about four. You the, you could crowdfund this when it was available for four hundred, and I think it was four hundred eighty dollars. The light of effects are one thing. But the finger articulations was blowing me away right now. Like that's that's impressive. And the only the only negative I have about the figure is that it has a it has a little bit of savability, and I think it's just because it's so big. That's what she said. <laughs> And it's so heavy and I think and I think you have to really like like right out of the box It didn't want to stand straight up and down. It wanted to topple over So that was just kind of a bummer. It feels like it feels like that's good like that pose I got it in is pretty good. But yeah guys Thank you guys so much for watching and being a super one member here on Majin Planet. Thank you guys so much for watching as always guys until next time